Welcome to a ViewSonic unboxing. My name is Ray, and today I have for you the XG341C-2K. This is actually only our second ever mini LED model, our second ever gaming mini LED model. So this is a pretty significant model for us, and it is our first time doing an ultra wide that's a mini LED. So let's get it open and show you what you get in the box. Okay. Getting into the box, the first thing you're going to see is some of the documentation, uh, help you get started with the monitor, and as well as the cables. So we include with this monitor a display port cable, we include with it a USB Type-C cable, and we include with it an HDMI cable. All of these are actually significant cables for this monitor because the display port will allow you to do the highest refresh rate when using a gaming PC. The HDMI is actually an HDMI 2.1 cable and we do support full HDMI 2.1 on this monitor. So if you have a Series X Xbox or you've got a PS5 and you want to do that 120 hertz mode, this monitor totally supports that. And lastly, the USB-C. USB-C is really cool because that single cable carries the data, carries the audio, carries the video, but it also carries power. So on this monitor, there's 90 watts of charging power that are coming out of that USB-C cable, going straight into your device and making sure that your laptop, even a really big laptop, is staying charged up and fully charged with just this monitor. Uh, last but not least, our power cable, and then we have a USB cable. If you want to connect your peripherals straight to this monitor, you can actually use it as a KVM. That means that you can have multiple computers connected to this, but share that display, keyboard, and mouse, as long as they're all connected to the monitor. Uh, let's start getting the monitor assembled. The first piece we're going to see here is our foot. This is the bottom of the stand and will help the monitor hold itself up. You can see it's actually quite an enormous piece because this is actually quite a big monitor. Uh, being a mini LED, the monitor itself is about twice as thick as a normal monitor just to get that big backlight in that we need and all that technology. Uh, and I'll show you that in just a minute. Next piece up out of the box is this upright. This is the upright for the stand. So what we're going to do is actually flip this over, get our stand piece, line it up. And then there's a single thumb screw on the bottom of the stand. That's all you need to tighten and finger tight is perfectly okay. And there we go. Our stand is now fully assembled, nice in one piece. Next up, we want to connect our stand to the back of our monitor. So we're just going to pull some of the covering off of the back of the monitor and you'll want to connect it from the top and make sure that it clicks into place and the little latch goes down so that it's nice and locked. And then you can pull the entire monitor out in one piece. Now that we got our monitor fully assembled and out of the box, let's take a look at what we have and talk a little bit more about it. So this monitor itself is, as you can see, it is a very thick curved monitor. This has what we call a 1500R curve. That means that if this were to make a full circle, it would have a radius of 1.5 meters. So not the most curved monitor that we build, but it is a pretty effective curve, makes it very immersive for gaming applications. I'm talking a little bit about that mini LED backlight. It's got 1,152 zones. That means individual zones in this backlight that can completely control their brightness. So when you're using HDR as an example, uh, this thing is actually rated for VESA Display HDR 1400, which is the absolute highest spec of HDR for any monitor right now. Uh, and this one passed it with flying colors. So we're really impressed with the performance on it. On the more traditional metrics, it's got a 3440 by 1440 40 resolution and 165 hertz refresh rate, perfect for gaming. Though, if you want a higher refresh rate, you can actually forego the AMD FreeSync Premium Pro that this has, remove the FreeSync, and you can overclock this thing to 200 FPS. Uh, that's really great if you're doing competitive shooters where you're probably not going to be using FreeSync anyway, or any VSync for that matter, and you're okay with this screen tearing because you want the fastest response time. Well, on this monitor, you can do that at 200 hertz with a huge LED battery backlight giving you an incredible HDR experience. So it is something that you really have to see to understand how great this thing is.
Uh, going into the uh, stand a little bit, you can see we've got a full height adjustable stand for this, even though it is one of our larger ultra-wide monitors. Uh, and as I said before, HDMI 2.1, uh, USB Type-C, and DisplayPort are supported on this. In fact, there's two HDMIs on this particular model, so that you could hook up up to four different systems to this one screen. And that KVM functionality that I mentioned will allow you to switch between any of those on the fly and keep your keyboard and mouse. So this has just been a quick unboxing and overview of the XG341C-2K. Please keep watching this channel for exciting videos from ViewSonic.